This is a training video on how to successfully download one of the retrieved CapsoCam capsules including opening the capsule and completing the download process. When the capsule is retrieved back you should in effect dry the capsule so that no residual or no flush is actually left on the capsule that will interfere with the download process. Once the capsule is retrieved the first thing you should do is insert it into the capsule opener. Um, via loading it into the capsule holder to start with. You'll notice that actually on this blue piece that there is a little uh, an image on here which shows the orientation that the battery should be inserted in. So the capsule is actually tapered as from the magnet image you can see it won't insert incorrectly into the actual capsule loader once it's orientated in the right direction there's actually a magnet within the opener that will pull the capsule in you then need to use the green part of the capsule loader to actually align the capsule within the blue loader to do so insert into the green loader this will actually push the capsule further in to the blue loader push down and then lock this in place by turning in a clockwise motion. Once loaded in and correctly inserted on the top of the blue loader you'll notice there is an unlock and a lock symbol. Again turn in a clockwise direction to actually lock this in place. That will ensure when you take the blue loader out of the green loader that the capsule does not move. Then in an anti-clockwise motion remove the blue loader from the green loader and you'll notice that the capsule is actually further inside ready to actually be opened. The next step is to insert the blue loader into the capsule opener. When you insert this you need to insert it in alignment with the pre-fabricated holes and twist in an anti-clockwise motion to actually lock the blue loader in place. Now to actually open the capsule what you need to do is start to slowly turn the loader via the silver part here and then very very gently start to apply pressure as you actually spin around. Once you have completed this process you should see a tiny plastic cup actually come out of the bottom of the loader which was the top of the capsule. You then need to remove the blue loader from the capsule opener. To do this turn in a clockwise motion and then lift out and you'll then notice that you can actually see the exposed connectors on the bottom of the capsule. Now we move to the next stage which is the alignment process by using the CDAS system or the capsule data access system. The first thing to do is to load the software up on your PC. And then making sure that you've actually switched the unit on which is controlled via this green switch on the front. You should then get a status one orange light appear on the unit. Now from the home position that the loader should be in which is from looking face on at the unit the right hand side load the blue loader into the unit and then spin anti-clockwise 90 degrees which is the alignment pull. Push down and lock in place. On the software you then need to click onto the alignment button which is the first drop down on the second option in from the top left hand corner. And what you're looking for is to expose the connectors as shown in this video. To do that, spin 
ever so slightly around until you find that image and then using the lock-in port which is this silver button or silver lever should I say just here pull back towards the center of the unit to lock in place once that's done you're then ready to proceed to the download so lift the unit by pressing the middle switch rotate 180 degrees anti-clockwise and this is where the unit actually does the download lock in place and then you will then click on to the second option on just underneath the alignment button within the software and enter the patient data.